Oh, for sale now, Vehicle Max, we have a 2007 GMC Sierra 2500 Heavy Duty Crew Cab SLT, two-wheel drive with the 6.6 um, Duramax Turbo Diesel. Has brand new tires in the front that we just put on that has zero miles on them, just from here the tire shop. The heavy duty oval uh, running boards. Allison transmission. Has factory navigation, factory DVD. Heated seats, dual power seats on both sides. It's got the heavy duty mirrors with turn signal that uh, have your mode here for your blind spot. Car has a clean title and a clean Carfax. You can view right now at our website at vehiclemax.net. The rear tires are not brand new, but they got maybe a couple of thousand miles at best. As you can see, they're still almost nearly new. Uh, if you're watching this video in Auto Trader, let me tell you, it will cut off in three minutes. If you want to see the full 10 minute video, please visit our website, vehiclemax.net. Heavy duty tone package with your electrical connection right here. The uh, spare tire never even been on the ground. As you can see, the line's still, still on it. Okay, let me back off so you can see better. Okay, right rear tire, just like the other one. Not new, but probably maybe a couple thousand miles on them only. Okay, the running boards on both sides are in perfect shape. They have no dents or damage or scratches or corrosion or oxidation anywhere. This one here is new. They're all matching tires, by the way. They're not mismatched. We went out, uh, the two front tires were a little weak, so we went out and got two matching tires, exactly the same by the general grabbers. Car has no damage anywhere, no dents, no touch-ups, no hail damage, no bird droppings. Let's go ahead and get inside of it and get it started. As I said, we got a uh, dual power seats. These seats not only uh, slide back and forth, but they also move up and down. Power recliner, uh, lumbar support. It's got heated seats with memory for two drivers and the easy in and out. And what it does is uh, when you put the car in park and take off the key, this keys, uh, the seat uh, slides back a little bit to make it easy for you to get out. Wood trimming all around, of course, power windows, power door locks, cruise control, tilt wheel. And go ahead and close the door and get it started. Okay. Get the navigation going in just a second. Got the heavy duty braking down here for those of you guys that are going to do any towing with it. Okay. Let's go ahead and put it in map uh, navigation mode. There's your map. Okay. Uh, we're, we're indoors, so it shows it dark, but when you walk out to the sun, it shows it in a lighter color. Okay. Uh, we got dual climate control here. You can make one side warmer than the other if you wish. For example, let's put the passenger side here at 70 and the driver stays at 60. Okay. Uh, we've got uh, OnStar system, compass and temperature readouts right on the uh, rear view mirror, home link uh, garage opener, have our remote stereo controls here for right from the steering wheel, you can just go up and down in the volume, and uh, you can also change stations and change mode, go from AM, FM to uh, AM to FM to XM, right now I'll show you that it's got XM radio. Right now it's on preview mode because uh, the the, uh, the service is not signed up for. Okay, got wood trimming all around, starting here on the door panels, continuing over here on the side here, as well as over here, and on the dash, and continues to the back to the door panel over there. It's got um, also uh, uh, wood trimming in the back. Got the Bose uh, stereo sound system, little tweeters up there. Has 45,398 miles. Okay. This little light is on simply because probably the pressure, it does a tire pressure sensor monitoring system. It's on right now because um, uh, I guess probably one of the tires is off pressure, but that's an, all you gotta do is put the correct pressure. Car's running, I'm gonna rev it so you can see. The other light that is on is a fuel light, it's a little low on fuel, so, but there's no uh, check engine lights, no airbag lights, no nothing like that, okay? No anti lock braking system light. Rev it, okay. Um, what else can I tell you here? Okay, leather wrap steering wheel. I'm gonna go ahead and pan over it so you can see it's in great shape. It's not torn or damaged or faded or anywhere. It's nice and clean. You got buckets and console on the front. Okay, center console here. Storage down here. 
got the factory DVD player back here okay uh, you can also play DVDs on this screen up here uh, as long as the car is in park see that let me let it focus in it's a little hard to see here but it's a DVD it also plays DVDs not just a navigation radio Put the navigation back okay um, pan over the passenger seat in the meantime, let me tell you about the OnStar system. How that works is, uh, let's say you get into a car accident and one of the airbags deploys. Well, it sends a signal over to the OnStar center. They contact you through the car, make sure you're okay. If you, um, if you do not respond within a reasonable amount of time, they dispatch the emergency vehicles to come to your aid. Um, also, another service that they do is if you lock your keys inside the car, uh, you call a 1-800 number and you give them your credentials and uh, they'll send a signal to the car to get it open for you. If you're running out of fuel and you need to find out where the nearest gas station is at, they give you turn-by-turn -turn direction. If you run out of fuel and you're in an area where they have a road ranger, they can contact the road ranger for you to come to your aid. Uh, if you are needing to find a hotel, uh, they can give you turn-by-turn -turn direction to the nearest hotel to your location as well as restaurants. You have to pay for that service uh, once a year, I believe. Uh, I don't think it's that much. I think it's a good value. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and work the heated seats so you can see the work. They got more than one level of heat. Three being the highest, two middle, and the one is the lowest. Okay, power window, the driver one, the thing is automatic. Back off and show you. One touch. The rear windows are tinted as you can see. They go all the way down and get out of the way. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, Put the windows back up so you can hear me a little better. The car's running right now. All right. Okay. Got also automatic headlights. I already showed you the heavy duty braking down there. Tilt wheel over here. Okay. Let's go ahead and get this turned off. Oh, there's one more thing I want to show you. You get your automatic transmission with the towing haul mode. You press this, uh, the button back here to disable the. Uh, the overdrive that way you don't burn it out but it's got this feature over here to shift the transmission now you don't have to use that I'll show you how that works you put the car right now it's in park put it in reverse neutral drive and then you go one more and then that's where you come into this manual mode I'm gonna tap the little switch up and down so you can see it that's how you change the gears by tapping on it it has six gears and you tap down the downshift but if you're not interested in that you can just put it in drive and you won't have to bother with that Okay, let's turn that off. Turn the car off, and I'll go show you a few more things. Okay, pan over the driver's seat so you can see it's in great shape. There's no tears, cuts, or discoloration anywhere. There's no burn holes anywhere. Matter of fact, uh, it looked like whoever had this car was a not smoker because there's no odor of any kind. There's no burn holes on the uh, on the seats, on the carpet, on the door panels. I'm panning over the headliner now so you can see that it's not stained or it's uh, dangling anywhere. Got uh, also, um, I, don't know if, I think I showed you this. Yeah, it's got vanity mirrors on both sides that are lit. I did, I did show you that. Go ahead and pop the hood. I can show you in there before we conclude the video. Back here on the rear passenger area, this is a five passenger. We got two in the front and three in the back. and They all have an over the shoulder belt, including the middle row passenger, which uses this one here. Also, if you don't have a middle row passenger, you can pull that out and it's a little cup holder there and armrest. Back here, you got um, video input in case you want to put in like a Xbox or Nintendo or, you know, what's the other one called? I don't know. Well, one of those, you know, kids games, okay? Uh, PSI, okay? Over here, you get controls for the radios. You got little jacks here for uh, headphones. Again, uh, this is the factory uh, Panasonic uh, DVD player. Not aftermarket. The door panels are the same in the front and the back. They're two-tone and they got the wood trimming, okay? Over here, got a little, for you, that's for your child lock to hear you engage you. When you do that, it disables this inside door handle and the kids can't open it. You can only open it from the outside. To put it back to normal, you just press there. Okay, uh, I'll go around one more time. Again, uh, my name is George. If you have any questions, I can be reached at 305-218-5462. The website is vehiclemax.net. We're located at 3200 Northwest 37th Street, Miami, Florida, 33142. We're open Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., Saturday, 9 to 5, and we are closed on Sundays. Again, so I was telling you, you get power seats on both sides, power recliner and lumbar support. Pan over the passenger seat here real quick.
as we need to start concluding the video. There's no damage anywhere inside the car either. The glove box. Show you in the back here real quick. And we'll move to the engine compartment and finish it off. Okay. Come back here, pop the hood, and we'll conclude this video. Okay, as I said to you before, 6.6 .6, uh, Duramax turbo diesel with the Allison transmission. Get your sticker over here also, show you 6.6. .6. And it's in perfect running condition, still in the warranty. 100,000 miles, five years of 100,000 miles. Bumper to bumper, thank you.